Hello everyone, this is Team 8 presenting Challenge 4 for the IDC SS 2023 and we'll be discussing the securing of large language model based chatbots and enterprise vector database environments. First off, we discuss the unauthorized access of vector databases and its potential implications. An unauthorized access to vector databases could lead to the leakage of sensitive data or the manipulation of data in the database. This could lead to an attacker being able to control the responses of the large language model or at least make the large language model generate incorrect or misleading responses. Next, we discuss the vulnerabilities of large language models when vector databases are not considered. A prompt injection attack involves the generation or creation of a prompt and the usage of a prompt such that it overrides the system level prompt of the chatbot. This could cause an attacker to be able to access personally identifiable information or modify the behavior of the chatbot in some way. Next off, we have sensitive information disclosure, which is when you use prompt injection to obtain personally identifiable information. Next, we discuss the trustworthiness of chatbots and its reliability metrics. First off, we have the performance rate. Uh, performance rate quantifies how well the chatbot performs by providing answers that meet user expectations. A high performance rate would be that the chatbot is more effective at delivering relevant and accurate responses, and a lower rate suggests a need for improvement. Now, the performance rate is a straightforward measure, but it does not capture other important aspects of user satisfaction, which is why there is more than one reliability metric for chatbots. Next up, we have satisfaction rate. This is taken from user ratings or user surveys, and it is a user-generated summary of the chatbot's performance. As such, it gives an indication of how well users receive this chatbot and its functionalities, and how useful and reliable it is. A high average grade suggests that the chatbot is consistently providing accurate and trustworthy answers, and a low grade indicates that there's a room for improvement.